demand is a significant responsibility, and we don't give it lightly to, uh, to anyone. So it's my honor to be able to, uh, to be here today and officiate at, uh, at this change of command ceremony. A time-honored tradition, the change of command, passing leadership on to the next in line. It's the last chance for one commander to say goodbye, and the first chance for another to be introduced. Colonel Barlow, congratulations to you and your family, and welcome back to Wright-Patterson. I know that everyone is extremely proud of you. We all are. And what a privilege it will be to be able to command the best wing in the United States Air Force. This wing, this base, this community is ready for its next phase, and they are ready to welcome you with open arms. The Wright-Patterson community is optimistic on what the future holds. Colonel Barlow's got that command experience that I think is uh, so vital to, uh, to being able to step in and hit the ground running uh, right here off the bat. And I know she will do certainly, uh, certainly that. And Colonel Barlow couldn't be happier about taking command of a community of such professionalism. Today I feel much like a United States Olympic team coach. I've inherited a team of professionals that know all the plays and what it takes to be the best. I am proud to be your coach, your cheerleader, your mentor, and your confidant. I look forward to being a member of your team and serving with you as we continue the tradition of excellence that you have established. Colonel Barlow accepts the challenge as the new 88th Air Base Wing Commander and looks forward to a bright future here. Reporting from Wright-Patterson Air Force Base, I'm Airman First Class, Richard Ware.